Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Queensborough Community College's annual Dean's List Ceremony and celebration of students achieving the 30 credit milestone in their education. I am Dr. Paul Marchese, Provost and Vice President for Academic Affairs, and it is my pleasure and honor to serve as Master of Ceremonies for this prestigious event. Allow me to introduce the college's administrator comprising the stage party for tonight's awards event. I ask that you, hold, uh, that you please hold your applause until all have been introduced. Ms. Rosemary Zins, Vice President for Institutional Advancement. Dr. Karen Steele, Interim Vice President for Strategic Planning, Assessment, and Institutional Effectiveness. Ms. Denise Ward, Vice President for Pre-College Continuing Education and Workforce Development. Dr. Arthur Corradetti, Dean for Accreditation, Assessment, and Institutional Effectiveness. Ms. Liza Larios, Dean for Human Resources and Labor Relations. Mr. Glenn Birdie, Dean for Academic Operations. Dr. Sandra Palmer, Dean of Faculty. Ms. Laura Bruno, Assistant Dean, Admissions and Recruitment. Mr. Franz Alcindor, Director, Acad Academy Advisement. Dr. Brian Kerr, Assistant Dean for Student Affairs. Dr. Margot Edlin, Interim Assistant Dean for Academic Affairs. Dr. Linda Reisman, Faculty in the English Department. Dr. Andrea Salas, Faculty, Health, Physical Education and Dance Department. Mr. Scott Belzer. Academy Advisor for the Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics Academy. Ms. Gail Patterson, Academy Advisor for Health-Related Sciences Academy. Ms. Natalie Rupchan, Academy Advisor for the Business Academy. A special thank you to the individuals who assisted in organizing tonight's event. Olga Salamanca, Carol Imant, and Delka Rahimi from the Office of Academic Affairs. Ms. Linda Burkhardt Buarto and Janice Mancuso from the Office of Accreditation, Assessment, and Institutional Effectiveness. Stephen DiDio, Tim Hillis, David Moretti, and Phil Roncaroni of Marketing and Communications. Victor Fischera, Event Organist. Uh, Richard D'Amato, Printing. John Funky, Queensboro Performing Arts Center. It is my pleasure to invite to the podium the president of the college, Dr. Diane B. Call. Thank you. Well, welcome. Good evening. And welcome to our celebration of Dean's List students and a very special welcome to the families and friends who have supported our students. People, people will often ask, what makes the difference for student success? And the underlying factor, in fact, is the family support, the support of friends. And so I thank you for being with your students today because we're very proud of them and I know you have had a great deal to do with supporting their academic journey. Well, certainly the road to academic success at Queensborough can be a challenge, as it can be for many, many students. It could be for economic reasons or academic readiness uh, personal responsibility, so many people do have obligations. But the students who we're celebrating tonight really have focused on coursework and persevered and really achieved an academic excellence, a standard that is very, very high at Queensborough. So my congratulations to you, the Dean's List students, and to your family and friends who encouraged you through homework, through reports, projects, exams, and finals. Almost 16,000 students attend Queensboro. And over the last year, you were among one in eight students who achieved the status of Dean's List, an academic honor. To receive this honor, you had to be enrolled in a degree program full-time and completed at least 12 credits with at least a B-plus average. 
If you were enrolled part-time, it took you two semesters to get there, again, accumulating 15 credits with at least a B-plus average. That's not easy, but you did it. Community colleges are very unique to the United States, and in fact, they offer an incredible opportunity for some people to begin a journey to transfer to university, which most of our students do, so they can get a bachelor's degree and beyond, and hopefully come back and teach here. Wouldn't that be nice? Some of you are studying, so you can go out and join the world of work. Very important for our communities and our country. Queensborough offers you both opportunities, and most importantly, we offer you a very personalized experience. It's very hard here to get lost. There are many, many people who support you, who support our students. We have the academies. The Queensboro Academies are a national model. What they do is provide you a very special experience with advisement, and three of our wonderful advisors are here, to make sure that each step of the way, you have someone to whom you can go or ask a question or email a question and have an answer. So we're very proud of it. We have five academies. And so if you're enrolled in a particular area of study, you're affiliated with one of those academies, which is really a virtual experience. But what it does is create community. Very important for students to feel connected, to keep going, and to complete their degrees at Queensborough. One goal of the academies is to increase the number of students who complete their degree in two years. This is very, very, very difficult. Nationally speaking, it takes three years, four years, five years. But we have a special incentive for students to complete a degree program in one calendar year. It's called the Milestone Students. And we offer them the opportunity, if they're very close, to take that final course for free. That's called a Milestone Scholarship. And you'll be hearing more about that in the next few weeks as you receive information for potentially to receive um, a milestone scholarship for the summer, for January, or for the summer. Community colleges are very special in the United States. There are very few countries that offer this experience. Anyone who wishes to succeed and try higher education is certainly welcome to do so at a community college. And almost half the students in the United States study at a community college. There are probably more than 1,300 throughout this country. We happen to believe that Queensborough is among the best, and we've been noted as such in national recognition in a variety of settings. College is a very different world, and it really requires discipline and determination. As Dean's List students, you've demonstrated you have academic ability, and you have personal discipline, and you are very determined. And all of us at the college are committed to your success. Through our excellent faculty, through personalized services to assist you with all aspects of the college career. We also provide additional financial support, and there are scholarships for students who are continuing. Again, you will be receiving word about that and we encourage you to watch your Tiger Mail. You've heard of Tiger Mail, right? How many people have Tiger Mail? Thank you. <laughs> Get some pretty interesting news on Tiger Mail. The scholarships are supported by a group of very helpful friends, our foundation members, our alumni, our friends, and current students who help to raise money to help other students achieve their degrees. So tonight we celebrate your accomplishments. And we look forward to seeing many of you at graduation this coming May. Actually, it's June this year. It's Friday, June 3rd. So mark the day down. How many of you are graduating at the end of the spring semester? Then I shall see each one of you there. You will walk across the stage in front of your family, your friends, and the world, because we live stream it. And I will congratulate you then, but in advance, all, all the best to you as you continue your degree, finish it up, and again, congratulations on achieving incredible academic excellence. It is a rare, rare honor, 
and you clearly are wonderful students. So thank you. No. Thank you, Dr. Cole. Being named to the Dean's List for one or more semester, semesters is a remarkable achievement. Students who attain this recognition have succeeded academically in an array of courses with a variety of professors. Each Dean's List student will receive a recognition lapel pin. I invite each of you to wear your recognition pin frequently as a symbol of your achievement and as a personal reminder to motivate you to continue your excellent work and to inspire your colleagues a similar level of achievement. Ladies and gentlemen of the Dean's List, you have met a standard of excellence in your academic work that places you among a select group of undergraduate students nationwide. On behalf of the faculty of this college, I express, express appreciation for your academic commitment. Members of the audience, please join me in giving a resounding recognition for this academic excellence. Congratulations, scholars. I am now pleased to invite Dr. Margot Edlin to the podium to confirm to con to confer the Dean's Lens Pit. As you see that there will be ladies and gentlemen at the end of the row to help you, please exit to your right, come up on stage, and go back into your row on the left. Katrina Bautista. Sundas Fayaz. Renz Nika Degula. Francesco Ferrer. Andreas Kaliakanis. Andrea Varela. Jitaik O. Abby Gail Williams. Megan Weiss. Harrison Bien Ami. Evelyn England. Roshni Subkaran. Alicia Roberts. Amanda Muscrop. Zhu Zhang. Lauren Portnoy. Jessica Herrera. Angelica Herrera. Sapna Patel. Nicole Chiarolo. Iselso De La Cruz. Michelle Clark. Afroza Ahmed. Jenwei Lee. Yan Yi Chung. Kimberly Hauer.
Ron Russell Bringas. Joel Centeno. Chloe Velasco. Justin Lee. Christopher Merck. Alexandra Toomer. Hyatt Swan. Jennifer Arenas. Dennis Brown. Anna Zarate. Stephen Palmer. Yvonne Vargas. Christina Baran. Hannah Kim. Fabio Aluzo. Zoya James. Amanda Negron. Christina Jackson. Christine Villanueva. Doris Chalco. Mahib Chaudhry. Sophia Worrell. Zhen Qiang Wang. Ji Yin Lu. Fraz Siddiqui. Jelani Lantigua. Siu Ho. Sandra Citeros. Tao Hong. Sion Yo Cho. Wilfrey Kim. Danielle Heath. Antonia Bastian. <laughs> Micah Lewis. Georgiana Sitaram. Francesa Manelas. Frances Manella. Jennifer Huntley. Daniela Castro. Natalia Pascualim. Roberto Zamora. Okay. Camille Seabury. Susan Palmer. Adonis Lopez. Zee's Wing Shum. David Jimenez.
Javier Perez. Paula Zuluaga. Leanne Romano. Saskia Persaud. Toshia Cummings. Susan Furman. Lisa Bano. Rizel Fenina Flores. Elizabeth McConney Bingham. Fernando Santiago. Renee Roberts St. Hilaire. Peter Petri. Adamanda Dios Niapas. Vincent Garidi. Berlinda Uasu. JB Talisma. Is that close enough? <laughs> John Howard. Galit Kaufman. Joanne Perez. Isabel Pierre. Pierre? Andrea Morrow. Antonia Tavares. Umbrina Ahmad. Koma Budu. Aragama Sirasumana. William Dennehy Paranello. <laughs> Kalam Kim. <laughs> Annie Savalos. <laughs> Vanessa Joy Bethune. Jasmine Lawrence. <laughs> Wen Xi Hu. <laughs> Shakir Drake. <laughs> Akeem Phipps. Saif Ahmed. Matthew Persaud. Peter Ashley. Chengi Tang.
Donald Jean-Pierre. Nadika Lachman Singh. Kemba Charles. Christina Correa. Ilyasu Bukhari. Jeffrey Salazar. Sandra Flores. Miguel Henriquez. Myra Palencia. Catherine Palencia Serna. Jennifer Gonzalez. Valentina Halilaj. Jose Melendez. Sheena Baptiste. Joni Lawrence. Yin Yun Zheng Li. Pablo Cruz. Ibrahim Idrisu. Priscilla Andrade. <laughs> Kenneth Contreras. <laughs> Carlene Gale. <laughs> Lisa Gray. Junae Jafar. <laughs> Sihang Li. <laughs> Eric Subilaga. <laughs> Jean Bernay Sharonfant. Hamza Khan. <laughs> Ziying Chen. <laughs> Regine Hayes. <laughs> Kainat Shahaz. Xiang Yu Cheng. Jin Yang. Omarine Perez Delgado. Stephanie Amagon. Lin Jun Shi. Alvaro Armas. Tulasha Thapa. Thank you. 
Mariela Ramirez. Lalita Persaud. Baruj Macliff. Martha Cardoso. Luis Amesquita. Edgar Milan. Rosalind Lozano. Katia Cardenas. Dulce Hernandez. Angela Skillas. Priscilla Polanco. Danielle Martini. Jun Kiang Huang. Gia Mulim. Dominic Brzezowski. Christine Khan. Patrick Rujmoja. Svetlanovska Noor. Leo De Jesus. Oh, okay. Wait, wait one moment. A little early for the milestone, I'm sorry. Hold on one second, sorry, that's okay. We're not ready for the milestone, just wait right there. We're f you're fine, wait right there, okay? Everybody's fine, okay. These things happen, but it's a live event, what can we say? We have one more Dean's List student who cannot make it to the stage on her own power because of mobility issues. Dana, are you in the audience? Can you wave to me, Dana? Dana Stropke? Yay! Hi, Dana. Everybody just bear with us while we give Dana her pen. I'd like to congratulate all our Dean's List recipients for the spring 2015 semester. I'm now pleased to invite Dr. Brian Kerr to the podium to introduce the Academy Advisors, who will be distributing the milestone pin. So you're all ready. It's all good. Okay, Dr. Kerr. Thank you, Dr. Hey, I'll be right with you. Thank you, Dr. Edlin. I'd like to introduce a couple wonderful colleagues at the college. To my right, Ms. Natalie Rupchan, who is an Academy Advisor for the Business Academy. <laughs> Ms. Scale Patterson, who is an Academy Advisor for the Health Related Sciences Academy. And Mr. Scott Belzer, who is an Academy Advisor for our STEM Academy. All students who enter Queensboro through one of five academies based on their field of major interests, um, and I said a couple of the academies by mentioning the Academy Advisors, we have five academies which are business, health-related sciences, liberal arts, STEM, which stands for science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, and as well as visual and performing arts. These academies were created the theory and thought in mind was to make sure you were successful. We wanted all students to reach their academic goals, hence our academy structure, the Queensboro Academies. Tonight we honor students who began 
uh, at the college in the fall 2014 semester and completed their 30 credit milestone in the spring 2015 semester. Congratulations, you are halfway to completing your degree. So, students who have achieved their, their milestone recognition tonight should have received a blue card. <laughs> Brit Brittany's got her blue card. Please bring that card with you as you rise and come up to the stage and receive your pin. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> Brittany Peguerre. Anais Ward. Yeah. Belkis Rodriguez. Yeah. Winnie Yu. Arif Deonare. Uh, Kimberly Antone. <laughs> Galel Mathurin. <laughs> Joangela nu Noel. <laughs> Mohammed Zafar Sadek. Zachariah Kahafagi. I know your name is not Milestone Card, so it's on the other side. Elizabeth Perez. You look familiar. How are you? Lena Morales. Amanda Puhi. Uh, Dalme Birch. Jordan Neiman. Kimberly Arias. Daniel Ferrara. Uh, Patricia Grippy. Okay. Um, Shanice Willis. Liming Kang. <laughs> Shirley Chen. <laughs> Maria Perez. <laughs> Talasha Tapa. Antonia Tavares. I'm told there are a few more Dean's List recipients. So come on up and we'll give you those pins. Donna Edinburgh. Lena Morales. Amanda Puhi.
Diomi Birch. Kimberly Arias. Daniel Ferrara. Galil Matherin. Kimberly Antoine. Elizabeth Perez. Joan Joangela Noel. Patricia Grippy. Last but not least, Arif Dionorin. Dionorin, my apologies. Naziba Farai. Any more takers? <laughs> Farzana Akhtar. So if we, let's take a moment to congratulate all of our recipients. So congratulations to the fall 2014, spring 2015, miles, cohort milestone students and Dean's List students. Dr. Marchese. Thank you, Dr. Kerr. This marks the conclusion of tonight's ceremonies. Students may pick up their Dean's List certificates in the two vestibules, that's outside the Humanities Building, uh, not, not outside, by the lobby. Students with last names beginning with A to L will exit the theater lobby and go to the right. Students with last names beginning with M through Z will exit the theater and go to the left to, re to receive their certificates. Everybody know where they're going? What's that? The Mets. Oh, and we'd also like to congratulate the Mets. They won. <laughs> Once again, congratulations, Milestone and Dean's List recipients.